So we almost made it through the weekend. Today's day nine. One of my favorite internet personalities, actually. And uh, so we're gonna be giving Valor a bath and doing some other kind of fun stuff today. This idiot is posting on every single one of my videos. He posts the same thing. Not to mention, not to mention this guy's hiding behind an anonymous profile. Like, I do a lot of critiques. Like, for design, you have to get your work utterly shit on by people, constantly. Like, they have to tell you what is wrong with your work so that you can make it better. That is exactly what I want. Good critiques, good feedback, things like that. What this guy is doing is the opposite of that. He is just putting toxicity out of the world. That is it. I'm a firm believer in this because I do a lot of creative stuff. I want to get better. I want my game to be as good as it can possibly be. And people like this utterly ruin that for you. And they don't do anything that can fucking help you. If somebody just constantly shits on you and then doesn't provide any way that can help you or make you better or improve you, they suck. Don't listen to them. Damn, I actually feel like I went pretty nuclear on that asshole that was commenting on my shit, but when you take the time and want to be creative and put your stuff out there in the world and then somebody's just an asshole to you for doing it, um, it really, like, few things grind my gears, I guess, as hard as that. Um, especially, like, now that i found out that it's somebody from Got Games, like, it really doesn't bother me at all. It's just, like, some, some person from OKC just trying to be an idiot. So, I'm really not worried about it. So I think I'm going to keep working on that tile project from yesterday along with a 15 minute sketch, uh, do some building work and get on with my day. It's been a pretty sleepy Sunday so far. I, uh, I took quite a nap earlier. Like another thing that I'm, I'm thinking about in relation to this person is I'm, I'm trying not to just be horrible and mean back. Um, you know, somebody just throws all this negativity at you. The first thing that you want to do is just like, well, fuck you, asshole, you know, like just throw it right back at them, but the, that doesn't help anybody either, you know, that just makes them, especially if they're, like, redemptive, that just turns them further against you, so, you know, it's it's a tough situation when somebody just kind of throws shit at you like that, but, you know, I, I'm trying to make myself better, that's the whole reason I'm even doing this vlog in the first place, is, is to kind of improve myself and, and up my game, so, gotta do it. Right, so this is the last thing I'm gonna say on this, but when you get up the motivation to make things anything really you know like painting um making music video any kind of creation that you do um and this mainly goes out to people that don't make things and or think it's too hard or something like that there's 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 a lot of work that goes into it like for for making these vlogs i've had to learn to use new software i'm having to actually shoot all this footage and then edit it and watch other people and and, and actually study what I'm doing and, and try to get better. It takes a lot of time. I'm spending, you know, three to five hours a day on this vlog, just, just editing it and stuff like that. Like, it takes a lot of effort. Um, it, I didn't just do this simply, or, it, you know, it didn't just come into be. You know, this isn't effortless for me. Um, the, there's, there's a lot that goes into the, the paintings that I make, the art that I make, the designs that I do. You know, all of this takes a lot of effort and a lot of skill or uh, maybe not skill, but a lot of effort and a lot of work. Um, and so when somebody, you know, really anybody puts a ton of effort or work into what they're doing, and then your only answer is to tell them how bad it is, uh, you're, you're literally doing like the worst thing to that person. Like they would never do that to you, you know? Something that, that you're actually that you've self-motivated enough especially if if somebody's like depressed or dealing with that kind of those kind of issues you know self-motivating self-motivating and actually getting out and doing things seems impossible a lot of the time like i've been there it, i've given multiple years of my life to that it's not pleasant um and so when you actually get up the motivation to make things like on this vlog i've made all the music i've made everything um i'm making art on the vlog uh, so it, for somebody to not take that seriously or just take a shit on it, it's fine if you don't take it seriously. I, like, I, I really don't care. I'm just trying to improve myself. This isn't, 
like I'm not trying to make a living from this, especially not right now, but to just take away from that and not try to help me further myself, which is what I'm trying to do, anyway, just it is really shitty. To further add to that point, I think a year or two ago, uh, I never would have had the motivation or the effort to even, or the effort level to even get two days into this vlog. And here I am, almost ten days in, um, making things that I, I think are, you know, decent content. You know, I, I feel like every single day the vlog's gotten better. I've gotten better at editing it. Uh, it's gotten quicker. It, you know, I'm, I'm moving in a direction that I'm happy with right now with this, so... I don't know, I really don't think you can ask much more than just kind of constantly, steadily trying to get better. Um, like if I expected to just make incredible content and go viral instantly, you know, I'd just be fooling myself. There's, there's no way that I would do that. Um, like especially with the, the, the content that I made in the first couple of days, like, you know, I, I think it's watchable, maybe, but, but not on, on like a truly massive scale. It's not this kind of really sugary vlog content that the top guys are able to come up with. You know, I just don't have the kind of money or, or the ideas for that yet. You know, hopefully I will. The idea is just to get better at all times. You know, like who knows what eventual level you're going to make it to. It, it could be higher or lower than you could ever imagine. So. It's time for a sugar bath. we got a technique for we're going to walk her and then we're just going to walk her into the bathroom. Big Sugar sees other dogs. It is not pretty. She, she is not Big Sugar. She's a big poop. So it kind of has a stopping point for now, liking how this is turning out so far though. ASMR chewing gum. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it inspired us to go get. This is a pretty slow night, but I got a pretty early start tomorrow. Tomorrow's gonna be pretty busy. Bye.